Hey friends, this is the Miss Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead and welcome to our series on holiday instant coffee mixes. Today, we're going to make cafe mocha. And what you're going to need for this is three, uh, two tablespoons of coffee whitener, two tablespoons of instant coffee, a quarter cup of sugar, a third of a cup of instant powdered milk, two tablespoons of semi-sweet chocolate chips, or you can have milk chocolate if that's what you like, but I suggest it be real chocolate and two packages of instant hot chocolate mix. Alrighty, let's get started. Now this is one thing you do need a blender for if you're going to use chocolate chips. We're just going to put those in there. Let's get our funnel so we keep things neat. Our, whoops, poof, our powdered milk, our sugar, our coffee, and our coffee whitener. This is one of those, those things, folks, that is so easy to make and it pleases so many people. Get this now, if you don't have a magic bullet, you can use a blender or a food processor or a small food processor. Whatever you got going on. Now we're just gonna grind. And Bob's your uncle. We have instant cafe. Well, you caught it folks, even when I didn't. I heard it, you guys all yelling. Where's the hot chocolate? I forgot it, didn't I? There we go. We're going to put this all back in here. And we are going to add our two pouches of instant hot chocolate. I knew there was something I was missing. Now, because all our other ingredients are nicely ground, we really don't have to grind this again. We just need to shake it up. Oops, I spilled a little bit. Tamp that down. Oh, that's a full jar. I'm going to say there's five cups of coffee in this jar because it's a quarter cup of this powder to one cup of hot water. And when this jar is full to the rim, that's a cup and a quarter. And I've gone ahead, as with my other coffees, and taken a piece of old Christmas cardstock, and I've written on here, Cafe Mocha, one quarter cup to one cup of boiling water, and I've punched a hole in the corner. And what are we gonna use for fabric this time? Well, I've still got some of this Christmas fabric left, so let's use that. And if you don't have Christmas fabric, folks, it's okay. Use wrapping paper. It works just as well. I just happen to be lucky enough to have a lot of quilt fabric. So I'm just going to fold this and fold this and if you've seen my other instant coffee holiday coffee videos you're gonna know what's coming next I'm just gonna do this I'm gonna point the point into the center of the jar and I'm gonna go out about I don't know an inch and a half to two inches and I'm just gonna cut it off with some pinking shears we're gonna pop our handy dandy rubber band down over the lid, fluff up our skirt. Now, as before, I have said, you can decorate this any way you want. You can use Christmas wrap, you can put little ornaments on the ribbon. It's totally up to you. But these are a wonderful generic gift to have handy if folks come calling if you get Christmas carolers or folks coming to visit and dropping in over the holidays, they also go wonderful with a basket of your home-baked goods 
for a stunning Christmas present. This is the Mrs. Volfi from our Half Acre Homestead saying, Instant Cafe Mocha. What a great gift idea. Take care. Bye-bye. Thank you.